Well, that didn't take very long. The alleged assailant in the assassination attempt on the federal judge has already been found dead of a self-inflicted gunshot wound, probably most likely to the back of the head. Funny how that can happen. Uh, there's some conflicting reports right now from what I've seen that uh, the target of it may have actually been the husband uh, of the judge. The husband has been a uh, private in private practice as a defense attorney uh, for a while now, but prior to that, he was a prosecutor for uh, 10 years. But ironically, the uh, one of his big clients as a uh, defense attorney has been uh, gang members of the Bloods gang, uh, of you know, Bloods Crips, that kind of stuff. Uh, you know, it's a standard thing. They're not putting out a whole lot of information on it. Everything is, you know, we're investigating. But it uh, didn't take very long for the person to uh, show up dead. Always, uh, always funny how that works out. Keep your head on a swivel.